Hey guys, what's up? It's Maverick the Enigma here back again, bringing you some Let's Play Soul Calibur 2, and this time we're gonna play as Raphael. Raphael Soil, 32 years of age, from the French Empire. Ooh. 5 foot 10, 159 pounds. November 27th was his birthday. Blood type is A. He has an English sword known as a rapier. And his name and his name is Flambert. His discipline, which is his fighting style, is La Rapiera de Sorel. His family, his foster daughter is Amy, and all his relatives he cut all his ties from. He doesn't even deal with it. Raphael, the young master of the Soil family, grew up with the rapier and medicine as his playmates. His cool, unemotional demeanor created many enemies, but his quick and precise decision making and execution skills solidified the foundation of his family amongst the nobles. Unfortunately, Raphael was cast out one day when he made a critical mistake. Raphael hid himself in an impoverished town to escape from his pursuers. There he met a little girl named Amy, who hid him to get Raphael from his enemies. For the little girl, helping Raphael was only a simple deed, motivated out of spite for the soldiers. For Raphael, however, it marked the first time he owed his life to someone else. He felt emotions that he had never experienced before, and Amy became an irreplaceable presence in Raphael's life. Convinced that the chaos of war was no place to live or meaningful life, Raphael took Amy and left the poverty-stricken town, but even with the new surroundings, he could not get Amy to open her heart to the world. One day in the library of the mansion he acquired under dark pretenses, Raphael found a letter with references to the evil sea. It wasn't long before he made the connection between the evil sea and soul action. What if such a sword were thrust into the hands of pathetic nobles? We would all be worth it if it the petty, warmongering nobles who could be eliminated to secure a meaningful future for Amy. But in order to accomplish this goal, Raphael needed Soul Edge. He was determined to attain the sword by any means necessary. A grand, insane plan was brewing in his mind. All for the sake of a young girl. Need I mention he's left handed? Versus Talim. Huh. Yeah, buddy. She Raph rides the wind freely, singing her wind songs. You're quite the rude one. <laughs> wind, guide me. Final battle. Oh, this Fight. sword is English. Guard, Ale. Wow. His moves are kind of flashy for me, though. Raphael is a good character, but I don't prefer using him that much. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I'm good with him, but I just don't prefer. Create a hardened warrior. Well then, let us dance. This is one of those low key people. But you don't know that. That little kick, though. His moves are kind of flashy, kind of like Danny Cage in Mortal Kombat. I like that quote. Because beasts sometimes do know when to give up. The power of darkness turns the gears of madness once again. Don't think you can flee. <laughs> you don't scare me. Fight. Actually, no, 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 no. Come over here real quick. Come over here real quick, bro. What is that? Bro, I'm trying to grab this dude. He won't even let me grab him. Bro, yo, chill. Chill out. Chill. Chill. No. Okay. I thought he was about to kill me for a minute. You win. What is that? Practicing his fencing? Taki. No good. She raises her swords to strike down demons. Don't ruin to your chance. I'm 
irritated. Nothing personal, but I must win. Final battle. <laughs> We're gonna see about that. Yeah. Do that flash. Yeah. Watch this. Da, 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 da. Da. I love that move. Let me do it again. And she's out of here. You win. Die already. <laughs> Versus Maxi. How boring. His soul burns violently for vengeance. You cannot go against my blade. So, you want me to knock you out? Final no. Battle. I want to knock you out. Dang. Ooh. Dang, Maxi, Maxi, listen, dude. Dot, 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 die. Ring out. You win, fool. You delude yourself. That's why I like using Raphael because of his poke move. Versus <laughs> No good. His motivation. I can use it to ring out cheese. Don't cry. Final battle. Fight. Oh no. Good. Ah, okay. I send a power. That little spinny he did right there. You expected an easy fight? Versus Nightmare. Oh boy. Two blondies going at it. You are too weak for that. Aren't you? You conceited, wretched human! Final battle. Fight! Ah! Wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. None of that, bro. No, I thought I was guarding that. No. Ah, dang it! I should have guarded that. You have failed, but I will not. <laughs> this guy. Ooh, I skipped it. Dang it. The seal was broken. I didn't feel like going through all this. Man. I just Final battle. Those Fight. Y'all forgive Fight. me, right? All right, here's where things get serious. Don't want to see that. So this is Soul Edge. That was weird how he was still laughing and it just the scene just shifted. Raphael now the true knew the true nature of the sword said to drive men insane. The man vowed not to be possessed by the braid blade and grabbed the hilt. With Soul Edge firmly in hand, Raphael returned to the one that he treasured the most. No one knows what was spared and what was destroyed during that time. If you guys enjoy this, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys later. Peace.